Welcome back to another GNL Watch Party. Today we are continuing X Men '97, Episode Five. So the title of, of this episode is called "Remember Me," right? It. Oh, remember it. <laughs> <laughs> But before we start the video, we would like to thank you guys for subscribing to our Patreon. And if you're not subscribed and you're watching the video and you like the video, make sure to give us a like, comment down below, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you want to watch the full video, it's going to be on our Patreon in the description below. But going back to X-Men 97. Yeah, it looks like we are not getting part two, guys. I we know! Didn't get the part <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Maybe they're playing with the titles. I don't know if they wanted to put part two. Is it be too cheesy for the title? Maybe they put remember it, you know? Maybe, well, you know what they're probably doing? It's just that they're going to tell this story and then part two is going to happen like the next episode or something. So this is happening in oh. between like, because because technically Storm is somewhere else, right? Then what, yeah. uh... Storm, if you guys want to recap, Storm was like, you know, having a bat, like running away and it's like, Somehow, she came back to the house, and this giant bird came out. It's a bird, right? The owl? The giant I owl. Of that. So she lost her powers, and she was going on a walkabout, and then Forge, Forge uh, met her at a bar, a supposed random bar in, I don't know, Texas? And then two days later, what happened? What happened, Gilly? Two they days fell later, love. or he fell in love. He love. fell in love. <laughs> Two days. Two days. And then, yeah. And, and then he tried to fix her. Couldn't remember people. You can't. Yeah, you can't fix. You can't fix people. <laughs> and, it was his uh, fault, by the way, that she, uh, she lost her powers, kind of indirectly. Oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah. So he yeah. kind of made he made the revelation that he he kind of made the tech to neutralize yeah. mutant powers because that's his thing. That that's his mutant power. He he was like he's a genius with electronics and stuff um but anyways yeah. yeah so storm is going through all this had some nightmare some giant owl and everything but i think our i think our agreed theory is that she's still in the machine she's not out yeah, of i think the she's machine. still yeah, yeah unless yeah the last thing we saw was the owl do domain expansion and that was it <laughs> yeah yeah and whispering <laughs> like yeah. I am you or something I can I control yeah. you. And I think the, the owl poisoned the forge. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, with the techno virus or whatever that uh, oh, yeah. that was similar to what Nathan the baby has with Sinister. I'm sure that will all resolve itself by the end, but yeah. So that's yeah. where we are. Uh let's get her started. Maybe we should take a page from the professor's playbook and give Eric a second shot. Do you think your team would still trust you if they knew? Cut. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Dang, it's true, <girl>. man. It's <laughs> true. <laughs> Let's see what's new on this intro. <laughs> Do you be so funny? It's been the same intro every time, and we say something's That's new. <laughs> Is that you? I don't okay, no, 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 this is the same. This yeah. is all the same. Yeah, this is but... the same. Oh, this is like the old one. There's no in between stuff. Oh, this is like the OG. Oh, wait, that's the Oh, this is new. This is definitely new. Oh, there's a. Uh... Okay, that, that's, that's from last week. Yeah. Uh, I remember this. Center. Oh, I don't remember this. I, I don't... Oh, no. I, I don't think I remember this. This oh. uh, maybe. Th this oh, I this remember. Is same. I That's the same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the game we play now with X Men '97. <laughs> What's different is it? Was it caused by atomic testing, or is it nature herself deciding the time has come to change the human race? Some say they're freaks, some call them monsters, but all over the planet they are known as mutants. We prefer to see it as a world that misunderstands us. Fortunately, helping us build those bridges is a journalist as esteemed as yourself. Well, I am just as flattered to be sitting with a renowned scientist such as yourself, Dr. McCoy. <laughs> <I was blushing laughs> blushes too, my dear. 
Here in Westchester County sits an unassuming English estate, the X-Men's home, a school for mutants founded by the late Professor Charles Xavier. Not like regular boring classes, more hands-on learning, you know, but with big death machines and vampire dinosaurs. For many of the X-Men, Xavier's school is the only home they've ever known. People who have fallen through the cracks, forgotten, desperate to belong. But that sense of belonging goes worldwide today, as the UN formally admits the mutant nation of Genosha. <sighs> this is taking forever. Gambit, please remember that should the new Black uh -oh. Man suffer a malfunction, <laughs> these three of them are all on board for whom gravity would most certainly be an issue. <sighs> Can it, you roosters? Look ahead. Hey, y'all. They be busy doing a bit of renovating since Gambit's last visit. Oh. This is like a vacation episode. <laughs> Whoa, what power is that? <laughs> oh. Just, oh. Let me use it, I'm no expert. Tell us in the comments, what, what mutants did you see? when we heard Madeline Pryor scored a top spot among Genosha's brass. Oh, the interim council wanted an X-Man. Luckily, huh? you guys could spare a gene. Gosh, madam. <laughs> Two always better than one, and far better than three. Most times. Forgive Gambit's passive adolescence. He insisted on coming after Rogue agreed to join me at the gala. I confess, the Master of Magnetism was surprised to receive an invite bearing the United Nations... He just call himself in the yeah. third person? I hear it's called... <laughs> The future. <laughs> Magneto, the, future. the interim council would love a word with you before tonight's gala. Privately, if possible. Hmm. So where the heck does that leave us? One time. Oh, oh shoot. A wet bird on a live wire. This is the first time we've seen, oh, we're seeing him, right? Kurt yeah. Wagner, how the heck are you, furball? Meine Freunde. We shall play tourist as the council speaks with Magneto. Kurt joined the council to help work with Genosha's various communities of faith. The things to see. Such I forgot. Th in this this city. is powers only in teleportation. Those faithful yeah. killer monks are his back okay. at the monastery. I think. Oh, a scimitar tongue gambit. You might have remain as had a second orphans. one in the comment. We have much to discuss since our gothic adventure amid the Alps. Come. Everything around us would not have been possible without the oh, we're that group. Of the X-Men. <laughs> oh. Oh. No, I, that's all they can afford. <laughs> that's all they can afford to the enemy. Uh, yeah, sure. Always used to say we'd have a place all our own one day. More than a place. A home. Daddy's charging pretty high rent. Ten dollars an apple. Overnight is not without its share. Oh, it is. Over in Vancouver. <laughs> that's part, that's today's prices. Well, I can't <laughs> help but ruin honey. They're Maybe accurate. Gambit's willing to ask questions no one else will. Like, why is Magneto suddenly mutant MVP? Oh, look at those moves. That's multiple, man. Oh. Who's this guy? Comments, help me out. Oh, Dazzler. Oh. A man named Gambit. Your poker face is very poor. Hey, mind your beeswax, Furball. Didn't go ringing for no priest. It does not take a priest to see you and Vogue's souls touch in every gaze. <laughs> Ain't the touch she be looking for. 
You Americans, so theatrical. Life is violins and close-ups. I blame soap operas. Just marry the bell and be done. Hmm. Scoundrels like me, we don't like get a no love triangle story war. this episode. We too busy for love. Too busy sinning. There is no love without sin. But love oh. is best measured in what we forgive. Wow. I Here's know some it's advice, yo. Yeah. Guys, voice. write that down. Write that down. <laughs> Scott, are you surprised to see such a bold move in world politics? Well, if being an X-Man teaches anything, Miss Tilby, it's to expect the unexpected. I always kept that in mind as field leader. Hey, uh, O'Shea's the weirdo at the lights. Can you take him off? I oh my can't. gosh. Sorry. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> take him <laughs> off. <laughs> take him off. Let's talk about you and Marvel Girl. I hear you're the X-Men's power couple. Oh? A love that spans galaxies. So I have to ask, when did you know she was the one? Oh. You're skipping the questions, too. Hard to interview someone who can't tell which parts of her memories belong to her and which parts belong to her clone. Even reacquainting myself with my psychic powers feels strange. Like the face of an old friend seen from every angle but the one in your memory. This busted mug ain't changed in a hundred years, and you know it. I remember so many things. So many with Scott. The two lovebirds still ain't tough. Another love triangle, guys. This son. is the second one. Although the way he's avoiding me recalls a time. Might as well name that so triangle. Just acquired man. the power of a cosmic <laughs> entity. The Phoenix. Oh. Right, you were there. I asked Scott to go on a picnic at sunset. She seemed nervous when I asked her to go out, like she didn't trust me. He was scared, afraid that he was like confessing in front me. of the camera. What the heck? <laughs> yeah. I wanted to show her that nothing had changed. She was still the hothead who knocked my books out of my hand when I ran into her on the first day of school. But I could already feel the universe speaking to me, much like Scott used to. Through our special psychic rapport. She snaps at me, and then she takes off my ruby glasses, which hold back my powers. I needed to anchor myself because every fiber of me hungered to leave and travel the cosmos right then. And nothing happened. Jean was using the power of the Phoenix to block my optic blasts, and we could see each other's eyes. They anchored wow. me. Wow. Focused me. His eyes made me stay. Now the, I know all about drowning in memories. The power of Let's eyes. Up and keep Remember that, keep guys. Because the past will yank you under if you don't. You forget how many sunrises your eyes have seen. The only oh. ever seen one of you, Red. Oh, just wow, oh. yo. Oh, and she's blushing too. Oh, oh, whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa, oh, whoa, oh. whoa! Aren't they married? Logan. I'm no, this is the clothes. It's fine. He's Scott Summers. <laughs> Those are the rules. You just forgot him for a sec. Enough said. Now go talk to that overgrown Boy Scout. Now, the latest adventure. Oh, Parenthood. That's crazy. Gene, Gene and I don't have any kids. You don't? No. Strange. I saw hospital records for one Nathan Charles Summers, born to Scott and Gene Gray Summers, just last month. Born at Westchester Memorial. Uh, I spoke to a Dr. Bryan's there. He said you oh, told yeah. your teammates this told Rogue. Pressing sure, him, yeah. wouldn't deliver my... He called my kid a freak. Scott, I came here today to give the X-Men a chance to show the world that mutants are just like us. People. Normal. And you lie. Why lie? Because you're normal. Excuse me? I said because you're normal. You're ungrateful. We fight, oh my risk God. our lives for you. Evil mutants, robots, crazy aliens. Scout. I Not gave him Boy Scout no more. I gave him up because you can't say thank you. Because I have to stomach your questions and prove that I'm a person. I lie because the this truth is, is we're nothing evil like Cyclops? you. Evil Cyclops? Thank God. Bro, this is the star of the only reason you evil are still alive. Recent on. events have aligned Interview. themselves in That's an bold. unprecedented fashion for our kind. With even the most overlooked of us finally getting a voice. We need to be thinking about how to speak loudly as one united community. 
This concerns me and my ex-ven. How? We need a handsome jawline that begs trust and respect. A poster child king. Oh, careful, Miss Oh, what's her name again? Oh, Miss Frost. Well, in this man's head with such yeah. notions. Yeah, Whose charitable idea was it to let a human be on the council? Were no others available to weep over semantics? Moira's a fierce ally to mutants, and we all agreed on a title of Chancellor. You eclectic allotment of social climbers wish for me to rule Genosha. Huh. Hilarious. One could argue, and many sadly do, that none of us would be here today were it not for you and your publicity stunt. Are there no others better tempered to stomach the squabble of human diplomacy? Aye, but Charles be gone, Magneto. And I may not like it. But if Charles trusts you with his X-Men, he trusts you with this. We were at a bar in Germany when he first mentioned his dream. Oh, here we go. Laughed. We're remembering it. Was he sentimental or suicidal? Both earn an early grave. He did that smile of his, that annoying secret smile. Magneto, any dream worth having is a dream worth dying for. We thought we'd perish before seeing the day when humanity accepted our people. Like Moses in the Promised Land. We would carry the dream. But never live it. Look, Magnus. I may not be Jean Grey, but I know what the professor would say if he was here. Time to dream bigger. You shall have me. On one condition. I Pistol. ought to knock you from here to the North Pole. You think making me your queen means we're oh, getting back? Oh, queen, yeah? Rogue? It is a political calculation, Rogue. Me, mutant kind's fiercest defender. And you, an echo. There's a twist on the triangle. Allows her to feel yeah. one's pain. A true leader, an empathetic one. Was this your plan all along? Make everyone like you and then take over? This was Xavier's design. It is why he gave me his X-Men, a final chance to uphold the promise we made to one another so long ago. But I need help. He needs a queen. For a fool, acting like this is all about you and the professor. I won't deny my passion for you. As with Gambit, loving you makes broken men whole, so that even as you deny us, our heartache is not in vain. Whoa. We would be lucky Whoa. to have you. Lead. Bro, this is a love story episode. A lot of <laughs> poetic <laughs> stuff going on. I know. Right? Like that. It is. Oh, God, anger is normal, even for mutants. Sometimes you just have to let go. There are some things worth holding on to. Describe him to me. Describe Nathan. I see him everywhere, in every face on every street, so clearly. I can't see color, but up here, I see these big brown eyes and this wild rust-colored hair. It reminds me of... Of us. <sighs> mm. Don't tell me! You can explain! Whoa, 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 whoa! Jeez. If you'll excuse us, Madeline. Something wrong, Miss Brian? Oh. Sorry. <laughs> Mine just drifted a moment. Mind that just drift went indeed. In, into a square now. Communicating via <laughs> yeah. There's four people things, involved. Scott. Just stop it. Let me explain, please. Explain what? I know what I saw. Jean, you. How long has it been happening? Uh, Meeting with her with a the month, maybe. I, I was checking in after she moved overseas, but we ended Go. up. Go to Genosha. Be with my clone. Oh, oh that's some good what footage right there, yo. The TMZ. Was TMZ. <laughs> Grief. She's the mother of my son. That's the one thing I can be certain about right now. Do you love her? I love both of you. Bro, you can't do that. You Whole can't do galaxies that. galaxies beckoned me, but I turned my back for you. Sinister cuts out a part of me and you love it? That wasn't love in there. It's ego. The music's changing and you need a chair. Leader, father, husband. And you? You don't trust your memories. Do you even love me? My love for you is the one thing I remember amid this pain and insanity. Remember or feel, 
choose, Jean. Do not spin this on me. Do you love me, Jean? Or am I just a lovely memory? Oh! oh. oh. Jean! What is it? Did she get, like, What's psychically the... assassinated? Like, what? <laughs> well, yeah, what happened there? <laughs> no. Uh oh. Hey there. Wasn't expecting a lady caller. What's wrong, Shia? You best sit down. No. It was back after I ran away from my daddy. My evil mother was helping me with my powers. Said she knew a fella who could help. An associate. The man seemed nice enough. Seemed to want to help. Just not like I thought. He spent weeks talking about how mutants were special. How we'd have our own cities and culture one day. He even oh, no. had plans too, Remy. Oh, Mutant art, fashion, dance. He showed me that being a mutant wasn't just about my power. Oh. It could be <laughs> something more. She's blushing too. And when oh. we realized that his electromagnetic powers protected him from my touch, other things started happening. Oh, damn! But then I started seeing the hurt in him, like raging waters. There wasn't enough room in our affair for his demons and, and mine. When I joined the X-Men, Eric said he wouldn't want me to lose another family. He acted like it never happened. We both did. You gonna accept his offer? If Genosha's shown us anything, it's that we don't need to be afraid of change. And if I can play a bigger role in bettering the world, well, that's the whole reason I became an X-Man. You never wanted to make things official. I respected that. I played the Swamp Rat. And I played your share. All the expectations. Every time, looking at you, seeing all the things I couldn't do. Like telling Gambit the dang truth. I can't oh. touch you, Remy. Your heart may beat for me. Can you draw me I can't feel it. It's like Shakespeare going on here. You, you light up everything you touch. But never me. Oh, he's missing everything. Oh, it's <laughs> deeper than skin, Shia. Not this. He wanted this drama. I'll wager that fool will break your heart in two. Gambit always knows the odds. That it? In this game, he do. Till then, we be friends, mon ami. Oh. Just friends. Friend zone. Would you choose love or be the queen, yo? Love her down below. Get a palace. Dangerous dance floor. <laughs> A drink from my dashing Cajun? Not enough drink changed the fact that others be more dashing. Shit. Don't tell me these two are gonna start dating. No, I mean, what, what, what do we council. have now? We need to Got like a trapezoid well, going on. <laughs> Wait, that's still four quarters. Like, it's like an octagon. Like you take an issue with your choice. The trapezoid yes. with, uh, with someone Genosha's in the middle. With Jean in the middle. But will not only be protected, but cherished, as it is with all UN nations. Most other nations don't allow a terrorist to be their leader. Yet so many allow their leaders to be terrorists. If it eases your mind, Magneto accepted only on the condition that we ask one of the X-Men to govern with him. Rogue. What did she say? I uh, said, let me cook. Oh. Oh my gosh. Bro, some like. Oh. Yeah, it's like Shakespeare, yo, you know? Happy nation, 
sounds like Ace of Ace. Do you think it's easier dancing while flying? Mm. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's the rating on this? What's the rating on this episode? <laughs> oh. Crazy. Oh, oh whoa. She needed it again. What is it? Oh. Madden. Oh my gosh. More blood, yo. The other other G they get blood? Did she? No. Oh. She's a clone, so. Oh. Maybe she's expiring. Thanks for the dance, Sugar. But Remy was right. Some things are deeper than skin. Oh, no, she's saying no. The double cross. Turn it off. The music. Oh, get oh, everybody people. out. It's your mom, dude. Kill the music. Cable? You have to get everyone out. Now. He's coming. Who's coming? I see Cable, what's going on? Body slide. One. No, no. Not again. Oh. Eyes. You made it. You survived. No! I'm so sorry, Mom. Sorry for what? Oh. Oh my god. Let's just get nuked. I mean, the big turn. What a nation. Oh, Master Bolt. That guy's gone. Oh, it is Master Bolt. Dang. Wait, who's this villain? That was Master Mold. I think oh. it's Master Mold. Oh, oh no, Nightcrawler. He's not dead, is he? He's alive. Oh, thank so you. Gambit. How many? Too many. So huh? many. Some vile Godzilla sent him. You go at it, you end up dead. Can't even dent it. We're huh. trying to evacuate folks now, but the Morlocks, they they stuck in the bay. Right under its belly. And there's no way to them. A promise was made. Oh shoot. What the heck? All these tentacles. Wait. Yeah, this is kind of OP. Oh no. Oh, they're gone. What the heck? I like how the story became started from love, now it became more. Right, fire away from the gardens. Rule clears a path for Gambit to the Morlocks. Save as many as you can. We shall not live our days wondering if we could have saved more. Never much cared for roulette. Then how about we spice up them rules? <laughs> the other action is coming by now. I don't think it's enough time, right? Oh. Here he's got all the blocks. 
Oh, this is like not, this is like super master oh. mold. Oh. oh no, no, the statue. Oh, he's oh. Oh. Uh-oh, I think we're gonna see his true power. They shall be avenged! Oh my gosh! Don't worry. Leech knows Callisto will find us. If not her, Magneto. He promised Leech would never be scared again. The X-Men are no friends to the Morlocks. Mutants located. Oh no. That's just a head. Oh. Oh. What? Dang. Sick intro. Entrance. Oh, sorry, Miss Ami. Now kindly follow me. Oh. 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 Oh no. Wait, magnetic shield. Oh my god. No! Too dangerous, Jeff! Oh my god. Don't you dare, Eric! You hear me? No, he can't. This can't be his oh, last bad. Oh. oh. Oh no. Hab keine Axt. No. Ah, he's not dead. Oh, oh shoot. I now we're gonna see her true power. Mega No! Damn it, see your bet. And raise it! Oh my god. The cards always be in my favor. Oh, oh, oh. No, oh, okay, that's not, that's not vital. Uh, I think it's final, dude. Neutralize. Oh no. The name's Gambit. Oh no. Oh, no. Okay, yeah, that's good. <laughs> Turn the whole thing. I'm gonna kill him too. Remember it. Oh! I'll remember this. Oh my gosh. How many? How many, damn it? To reiterate for those just returning to us, regardless of your stance on recent world events, oh my. the images you are about to see may be disturbing. Wait, so Magneto and Gambit are gone? Yeah. No, no, no. no, no, no. Cable's going to fix this. I think. Oh. Sugar. I I can't feel you. Oh 
my gosh. Don't tell me that's how it ends. That's how it ends, man. Oh, oh my, my gosh. <laughs> Bro! What? Yo, definitely my favorite episode. I I am very... Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what just happened? Bro, everyone just got eliminated. Okay, okay. Hold on. No, no, no. This has got to be multiverse stuff, right? It's got to be. Yeah, I think so. Stuff. It's got to be, right? Yeah, because uh, Cable said. Cable knew this was going to happen, but I don't think he had enough time. Yeah, did he say, like, again? It's like not again or something like that? I can't remember. Yeah. So this is the start of Future Imperfect or whatever it is. Oh, I'm so confused. I'm kind of speechless on this episode. I didn't think they'd go there, but they went there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. The X-Men has no leader again. <laughs> but they got, wow. they got Cyclops, though. Uh, I don't think he's in the right mind right oh, now. I don't know. Man. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah. Well, wow. they're, they're all... They're, they're, they're between a rock and a hard place right now, so. Bro, that's crazy. Yo, we're, I thought we were just getting a, like, love a love story. story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then, boom, you know? Like, they I was just hit like, us with the crazy. And then, oh, and then, you know, usual cartoon stuff. Oh, they don't kill the big character. Do you know what they did? They were like, yo, let's save the, the animation, the budget for the second half of the episode, or the last <laughs> 10 minutes of it. Yeah, so we'll that's where all the budget went. And we'll take out two main characters just for the hell of it, too. Oh, God. Well, oh now God. I have no idea where this series is going to go now. I'm like, other than we still have uh, we still have Storm. Storm's story to go. Actually, she became leader of the X-Men at some point in the comics, I believe. Uh, somebody oh. can verify that in the comics, but yeah. Yeah, I thought Magneto was going to destroy it destroy that thing like, know, he's, yeah he's, that's uh, the end of the episode right yeah it's usually yeah. like oh he does his thing let it uh crushes it yeah Gabbit yeah, does it and then back to love triangle right where you know rogue is like it's gonna be like okay i have to be queen you gotta go because we gotta protect these people and gamut goes on his you know merry way but no <laughs> dang that was a crazy uh, way for gamut to go right oh freaking a yeah and 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 just what this oh that line I can't feel you is like oh <laughs> yeah well how about that line his, his last words was oh, it remember it remember it yeah remember it dang that that line goes even hard, harder even knowing what he did yeah oh man oh okay well we'll see where it goes next week <laughs> I don't know how they're gonna top that. Um, that, that was a that was the craziest like drama I, I've seen so far in a cartoon. <laughs> yeah, was it's like we, we've seen that in anime before, right? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's better than Last Stand. Better than Last Stand. Uh, <laughs> better than X Men Last Stand. Oh yeah, Last Stand. Yo, everyone just got eliminated. Oh, that's true. Right? Yeah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Gene came back. He's like, up. Oh, everyone's gone. <laughs> okay. I guess we'll find out next week. So, yep. Make sure to like, sub subscribe, comment down below, and check our Patreon. And until next time, peace. Latest.